our channel. Let's start with the news today. Fighting continued from liberations of Mariupol outskirts. General Staff. Fighting for the liberations of the outskirts of Mariupol continued on in Donetsk region. According to the latest updates as the 1800s, an uh, offense uh, operations against uh, Ukrainians continues. The enemy is stopped, had been uh, failed to achieve the goal in a timely manner. It suffered losses in the manpower and equipment. The general staff uh, of the Armed Forces of Ukraine posted on Facebook boldly ignoring the norms of international humanitarian law. The Russian invaders are launching missile and bomb attacks on critical infrastructure of Ukraine, civilians, residential areas, school, and kindergarten. The fact of holding civilians hostage, robbing the local population and looting are recorded, the report reads. The armed forces of the Ukraine are fulfilling their task of repelling out aggression against Ukraine. Deploying parts of the reserve in certain areas where we group uh, and counter-attack. As noted, fighting continues for the liberations of the outskirts of Mariupol. Soldier of the Azov Regiment defeated one of the units of the 22nd Special Brigade of the Air Force of the Russian Federation. In Luhansk region, during the day, the defenders of Ukrainians destroyed five BM-21 Grad and MLRS with ammunition to them, three T-72 tanks, one APC-3 and more than 15 enemy soldiers. These data are uh, being clarified. Measures are being taken to cover the state border of Ukraine and the sea coast. A stabilization operations is being carried out in some areas and territorial defense tasks are being carried out. As reported from February 24 to March 15, the combat losses of the Russian aggressors totals about 13,500 personnel. This is the end of our video today. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching and see you next time.